was the most dangerous, and even he was at the behest of the wolves he employed. The one thing you learn as quick as taking your first breath is that nothing is ever what it seems. The flash, the glitz, the stars only shine for those who choose not to see beyond them. Musa, I've been expecting your call. Did something unusual happen? No, nothing unusual. No, I'm studying the stars. You know, the most brilliant of them all. This one here. My eastern star. I don't know how to. And how can you be so sure I have this star of East? So what's the juice? Because of our relationship, I'm willing to sell you the Star of the East. For half price, 30 million US. 30 million fucking dollars for me? What do you want from me? You want cash? Then make the fucking deal! Seen this girl? Stop there. I want you to write down what I tell you. Don't worry, I'll remember it. Indulge me. I want you to write it down and keep it in your pocket, asshole. Let me explain. When she worked here, I was planning to come in and propose, but she disappeared unexpectedly. Has she been around since then? No. 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 Now listen, I'm gonna write this down for you. She's never been back here. Get it? She walked out the door, and we haven't seen her since. Is that clear? You've been coming into my place for two years. You're so fixated, you ask the same question time after time. Even though we keep saying we haven't seen the bitch! Get out of here! Sorry. Thanks a lot. Ruslan was not the brightest star in the room, but he never gave up. On me, that is. Neither did Armand. My two sidekicks, my two lovers, my one dilemma. Just come see me. Just come by. Have a nice surprise. You're nicer than usual. What's the occasion? What? Are you the surprise? Uh -huh. I'm talking to my daughter. How long have you been answering to the name Sweetheart? I wouldn't have hey, thought... listen, lady, when I want your opinion, I'll ask for it. So Mike promised to bring the stone today. Okay. It's my star. Of the East. Where do you plan to meet? We'll be at the factory, as usual. I'll put the boys there. There'll be no trouble. We'll be there in three hours. You're not going. What do you mean? She is. 
oil. It's my decision. Look at his face. See, I was right. He's happy. You lost your mind. You forget who took you under his wing after your father died, who fed you all these years. I remember. But I seem to be hungry no matter how much I ate. In your place, Musa. In my place? I remember. You had the look of a wolf cub two years ago. When I punished your little girlfriend, Ariar. You want me! Hmm. They're all ten thousand dollar bills. I didn't know they made them. Yes, they're rare. Uh, not available unless required. By those who can afford. So I'm going to repeat this for the last time. Mike is bringing Mr. Lowe's diamond to the abandoned factory. You'll have a security team and get us off. We'll lead the way. Cut us off. Cut us off. Huh? So where are you going? With her. And who will you meet? I said, who will you meet? Mr. Lou? Why the fuck is he talking about Mr. Lou? You're meeting Mike at the factory. Try to focus on this. I'm giving you 30 million bucks. Let's not fuck this up. I got it. I'm not a fool. Get us off, huh? Oh, right. I was told you took this job because you're looking for your girlfriend. Good luck. You won't find her here. <laughs> How do you lose a girlfriend? Believe me, it won't happen a second time. You sure? love for me. In a hopeless world, sometimes the smallest light shines the brightest. <laughs> Antonio! <laughs> Open the door from the lady. The 
Siberian definition of a blood diamond is where 30 souls suicide themselves in 30 seconds for it. A steep price to pay, but in this part of the world, it's an even trade. Last time, Moses said Armon. This time, I guess we got a <laughs> very, very beautiful young lady. <laughs> yeah. I like your sense of humor, Mr. Mike. I just hope you brought the money we all agreed on, right? <laughs> I may be beautiful, but I'm all business. Now then, the diamond. Hey, bitch, let's see the money. I hope it's, uh, 30 million. Exactly. Right. Oh, gentlemen. After all this time, you still don't trust us? It's 30 million. And how do I know that the stone is real? Let me see it. Is this your first transaction? Nothing we do is fake. This is real. Look at it! You see, when you're dealing with us, everything you see is real. Hmm. When laughing hyenas come out to play, all bets are off. Our particular breed of hyena eat their own kind. What you call a massacre, we call a fun day at the zoo. He wants to blow you. Hey, Baldy, want to give me a blowjob? Is that it? Suck this! <laughs> The best business is always clean business.
Melissa's well, gonna love the way you look with a bullet in your head. Now, Moose will have to update your portrait. When the devil collects, he sends your friend or your relative. A chilling reminder not to be late on the rent. But not to Musa. Blood made no impression. This one here. In fact, no one could hey, discern what he was thinking. And here, nothing was ever what it seemed. Nothing was what it seemed. But, but, but uh, boss, I had no idea what was going down. Hey, boss, there's a guy from Azar in here. Baby. Oh, I figured it was Kazar's guys who grabbed the briefcase, realized whose money it was, and then sent this fool to give it back. Am I right? Hey, so where's the stone, pal? You got it in your mouth? Is that why you can't talk? <laughs> Kazar sent me to find out what's going on with the territorial lines. You violated the divisions. It's his conditions that don't suit me. You know what's mine's mine, it's my territory. No one comes in here and changes the rules, okay? Fine then, forget it. They're just made up borders. Well, the ways of God are inscrutable. I remember. Boss, it was luck. Somebody had to tell you who stole the goods. Please. I was watching your back for you. Focus on this. When the Soviet Union crashed in 91, Musa was a general. So when the rich were running from the wreckage, outbidding each other to police the rest of Mother Russia, Musa split with his own private army. You better watch your tongue, boy. Guess you're gonna need it. I'm not your damn boy! Ah! 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 You son of a bitch! You ah! shot me! Ah! You're killing the music. Boss. Boss. You're killing the music. Uh, it, Why do you do that? Have you ever uh, used a gun before? You kill the moron? Uh, you uh, He's a fucking Arab boy for Kazar! I'm sorry, it was an accident. You stupid son Why do you give me bitch? these problems? Ah! It's always the same shit with you. I I'll swear, hey, you, you bastard! Shut the fuck up, all right, and go home. I deal with my people and myself. How the hell am I supposed to get home? Hey! You hey. shot me! Don't make me regret he didn't kill uh, you, okay? He only wounded you. Uh, 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 and why the fuck didn't you kill him? Why you wound him like that? You changed your mind. Trying, you know, you confused the shit out of me. One day you say you want to kill people, them. next day you want to save people, next day you want to hurt The prestige of every magic trick is to have your audience look one way. While the trick within the trick happens exactly where they're not looking. The art of distraction, misdirection. This clown in the paisley shirt was the distraction. The fear you see in his eyes was never real. None of it was. And Musa never... Is there anything as interesting out here as what you saw in the shower? Don't do this. You better stop kidding yourself right now. Why are you pushing me away? Who the hell do you think you are? Wow. Brilliant. You learn quick. You don't think I know where you're going with this? All that money. It's already in your car. You got a problem with that? 
We got a chance to split and get the hell out of here. No way. No, don't tell me no way. You're in a world of precision, the end game. And you pissed away your targets for a panic attack? You screwed up. You let a major mark walk away. And all morning I'm looking for you? Where the hell were you? How'd you find me? I can't explain now. I'm leaving, but I'll come back for you. So you don't remember anything? Don't worry, you will. <laughs> It'll come to you. Okay, I'm going to leave you. We'll go, but understand we can never come back. Thanks for helping me with everything. I'll be back very soon. I sent you a message. You brain dead? What the hell happened to the girl? I don't know. She jumped in your car and split. She left in a hurry, didn't even say anything. The end justifies the means. I did what I had to do. We had a raging pack of wolves clawing and itching their way after us now. And we didn't care. All we had was the two of us. And that's all you need sometimes. traitor Siberia's ever known. The mighty Khazar. He was medicated, he was schizophrenic, and his army was loyal to narcotics. The worst jet fuel known to man. You said you had everything under control. You have one day to get me that case on this table. And the girl lying next to She'll never belong to you. Do you think I give a fuck about that girl? Gather everyone. Sir? You heard me. Make the call. Don't you push it on me. Trusted? Batter was my father's best friend. Believe me, the man would never betray us. And if he should ask what's going on? Oh. 
If we keep quiet, he won't be nosy. I'll find you, no matter where you run. Just like a wolf. I'll sniff you out. For a wolf a hundred miles, it's nothing at all. Even a thousand. I'll catch up to you. Let's move! Aren't you coming? I'll catch up to you. Some would say David had more of a chance to beat Goliath than the two of us had to live for a day. We took our chance and ran. When you are consumed by love, you are bereft of fear. Look at you, Ruslan, all grown up. Like father, like son. How are you, uncle? Just fine. When are you gonna tell me, Ruslan? It's your palace. I've always wanted one of those. Hey, who's that? Well, there's always soldiers at a queen's palace. So I guess if I'm the queen, then... All the rest are my subjects? That's right. Everyone? Every one of them. The world bows at the feet of the queen. Come sit next to me. Queens shouldn't be alone. They should have their own prince. You could be my prince, and the whole world will have to follow our orders. Being alone is no fun. How does the prince get chosen? The way it works is the queen has to give the chosen one her heart. How do you do that? Oh, hold on a minute. Here. Feels kind of heavy. Hold it tight. It's yours now. Got it. Stop it. <laughs> Leave him alone. It's not yours. Get it back. Oh, on, stop. Maybe I do have a heart of stone. And that's why my life is like this. 
my queen. Joyous is the fortunate soul favored by her love. Hmm? Will you forgive me? I tried so hard to find you. I searched so long. Now, there's something I need to tell you. Sweetheart, it is me who has to tell you a lot. Tell me everything. Two years ago, I worked in a casino for a very rich man. Then one day when I was working at the card table, everything started to go wrong from the very first deal. One of the customers started winning big. First he doubled up, and by the 10th round he had tripled up. Usually in those kinds of situations, security will do something. They'll move the guest to a different table or change the dealer. It's a standard response to those situations, but not in this case. After an hour, he took his winnings, quietly stood up, and left the casino through the main entrance. He walked away with half a million dollars, along with my life. What do you think? Mm. It's excellent. So what's your name? Baha. Baha. Yes. No. Baha. Slick. As you wish, boss. And what happened to you? Arman. That's why he's slick. Bah. The slick. And who are you? Arman the slack? Nice music, isn't it? Do you know why I play? I'm just getting old. When I was your age, I was just like you. I made so many mistakes. I went into debt. I gave away the very rights to my life to others. 
A what? A mountain of death. Now I try to redeem myself. Through my muse. I speak of you. Why'd you lose this money in the casino tonight? It's my casino. It's my stable. It's my money. Why? The croupier is not liable. Alia, in any casino, every casino, everyone is a company. He owned everyone, including me. And all he wanted was me just for himself. Welcome to the world run by warlords. To him, a man of endless power, I was the one star he could never buy. Alia. How do we resolve this, hmm? Because I have to get paid. I have to get paid. Is there something else? Can you compensate me, Edward? So you can get through this? What can I do? I don't know. Give me something. Give me your use. So what do you say? Alia, do you mind? Because I give you this. I give you all of it. I make you master of it. <laughs> no. no. It's not as if you have a choice. Alia, you gave away the rights to your life to someone else. Hmm? You have a debt, and I gotta get paid. You owe. Damn me! And by the way, you can't hide, because I'll find you. I'll find you here. I'll find you there. I'll give you two days. Oh. Make it three! <laughs> Armand made me a proposition. I was desperate for anything. I could see you were trying to call, but it was impossible for me to answer the phone. From that moment, my life had ended. I thought to slash my wrist, but Armand took away even that option. He told me my life was no longer my own. From that point on, I shut down. There was no room for love in my new life. We're clear in Sector 3, proceeding to Sector 4. Armand brought me to Kazar. Musa conducted his dirty business. But the dirtiest business in the city was controlled by Kazar. Drugs and murder for hire. He was the only one who could deal with Musa. This was the residue of the Cold War. She's here. I was told... You'd sleep around, but you don't want to. You may need a job, but you... you are of no use to me now. It's like fire. 
A light or a match can light either a pipe or cigar. Both ways work. However, the true nature of the problem is one is natural. One is not. Matches are just better. Just like I'm better than Musa. Why bring her? So what can I do? The truth is... These are really games for men. She's a lot tougher than she looks. A shooter who's an expert. Here's your chance. Prove it. They called him Cube. He could do anything. He began training me for work. At least that's what he called it. I'd wanted to throw myself under a bullet rather than be an assassin to take away the lives of the innocent. Cube kept me to the program. I didn't ask any more questions. Stop. I saw how you were looking at Vera when she fell. I presume you felt sorry for her. You shouldn't. For you. I do a lot of things I shouldn't. I left the man who loves me and who I love in return. I'm getting ready to kill people for this son of a bitch. And I'm doing it so I can get money to another son of a bitch. Truth is, those sons of bitches live on a different planet. It should be one word for all. It's not your decision to make. Who does? Me. I'm in charge. Everyone's exploited. At least with Kazar, you know where he's coming from. So that makes it right. The only thing you need to do is pull the trigger. You have nothing to fear. Do it quickly, and don't lose your concentration. And refrain from asking too many questions. And I didn't ask any more questions. But at first it was hard. Let's keep this concise. On my command. Got it. It's critical. be recruited as a hammer all warlords here are in the crosshairs and to get out of hell my new job was just to crush
It seemed like it wasn't real. I wanted to be the best. I wanted to be Musa. If only for a moment. That rendezvous at the abandoned factory. That's the first time I failed to carry out an assignment. Say something. Talk to me. I'm sick. Ruslan. Do you want to stand in front? No! It will be exactly like in that movie. <laughs> Just go. You really need that. As you wish, my queen. But right now, I'm not willing to come down to Earth. It's clear enough. There's no need to talk about it. Please let me explain to you. I love you! <laughs> oh, I love you so much! Oh, come here. Oh, I'm so happy. Would you leave me alone? Please, give me a chance. This money will help us survive. Thanks, but I don't want anything from you. You should take the money and leave. No. You know this money will help us start a new life. We'll be able to leave. Oh, really? For where? Wherever you want. We'll just leave and settle someplace. We'll start a family. You'll be a great father, I'm sure of it. How many kids would you like? Three, four, how about six? Stop it, Aliyah. <laughs> Where were you for two years? How come you never tried to call? I'm sorry, I told you everything I did. Really? You've confessed to everything? And nothing! Has he been screwing you these two years? you a present. It's in here. Thanks. Come on in. You didn't need to bring me a present. I told you that. Hope you like them. Cost a lot. Forgive, Forgive me. me. <laughs> you know what's weird? When I'm with you, I feel like everything will work out. I really envy you. You've always had an optimistic vision about things. Even when we were kids. Wish I did. Hey!
So, that's the whole story. Okay, I've got it. You can rely on me. We'll be leaving tomorrow. You know where you're going? You like it? A lonely sailboat. Like a lonely person. Do you really think you need to leave? Fly away. Drive away. Or sail away. Sailing away is possible. An old friend of mine gave me that picture. Books here? You remember? You were only a little boy when we took that trip many years ago. He's a former customs officer. Retired. Yes, he lives in a little place. Where else could he live? But by the edge of the sea. After all those years guarding the border, he feels there should be a border for goods, but not for people. He lives pretty much the way he wants. I wrote his number down. I'll tell him you'll call. He'll get us a boat? You have no other way out. There's always a way out. Yes, Mr. Lowe. Musa, look out your window. Thing. No. That means I'm still waiting for an answer to my question. I don't need to repeat myself. Do I? No. You'll have your answer in the morning. husband walks in just when I'm about to come. <laughs> Bad luck. Everyone stay awake. I gotta go take a piss. Oh, like a racehorse. You could stop right there. Put the briefcase down. Now step back. everything as we agreed. What's this? Oh shit. Hey Squaw, get out of here! Hey Zara Kitchen! You really brought it. I'm confused. Why the hell would she pick you? We have an agreement. I return the money, and then you let us both go. In a minute, no one's going to remember what the agreement was. No need for the guns. We got this. Grandpa's about to have a world to hurt. We had an arrangement. Musa. I promised Kazan. Sue me. I'm not the one that's gonna take care of you. Oh shit! Oh, 
Come on. Let's go. Hey! Sorrel! Get in here. We're coming, we're coming. Don't turn around. Put the weapon down. You should have kept your word. Take the case and get out of here. Gone, Red! Help him. He... wiped out everybody. Drop the gun. Which one do I put it in? What do you mean? I mean, which car? There's ours and the one the bald guy came in. Do I have to draw you a map? If you hadn't asked me, which car would you guess it goes in? You know, in the end, it's who's still standing that counts. Friends are nothing. It's about money, weapons, and power. You're forgetting something. No, you're forgetting something. Anyone could be bought if you know the price. <laughs> so tell me, what did you have to come up with to conquer the Heart of Stone? How much? Armand, you can't buy love with money. Who beat the shit out of you? That's it? That's it. Need to kill them. And the girl. Oh, Musa finds her. <laughs> oh, I'm getting hungry. Where's the package? It's in the charm. <laughs> Hello, boss. Ah, ha, love. <laughs> hey, come on, let's pull over now. We're not in a big hurry, you know? You feeling better? Yeah, I'm good. Are you hungry at all? We need to get far away from these guys. Come on, you have to admit that's a pretty smart idea. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> what about that place? You want to stop there?
is it, boss? What? What's the matter? Boss? What the fuck is it? What the fuck is it? What is it? Let me do it. I'll punch you in the face! You fucking bitch! What the fuck is it? You found me! What you found? 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 So why'd you do that? I thought you were going to give it back, so I got up and switched them. You kept sleeping. I'm going to buy some snacks. Call books here. Everything's going to be all right. Well, just the right time to talk business. Yeah. 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 Is that a yeah? <laughs> At least I got a yeah. That's a step in the right direction. I haven't even told you why I called. <laughs> I'm liking this. How about a yeah to where my money is? Well, you got one guess. Only one! <laughs> Fucking magnanimous of you, nephew. I got one guess, you stingy little bastard. Could it be, could it be a little girl? A little Peshwa, you introduced the Gazar? Stupid move, Armand. You never gave her a choice. She would've wound up there anyway. Not necessarily, you know. She could've stripped down and just gotten in the bed. We would've all been closer. Your idea of close, it's not really an option. Well, in this case, it's the worst, but <laughs> fuck it, whatever. So what's it like on the run? What do you think? You set this in motion, you cut all of us loose. Why? You going for your work on a visa now? I'm just trying not to get pissed on. What do you say we amend the situation? Well, as always, you know best. Well, why don't we shake hands on it, at least, huh? Kiss and make up. All right. Which hand do you have that phone? The left. Why? Because I want to reach out to your imagination. You know how I picture things in my mind before I put them on canvas. I want to know that I appeal to the sensibility of your, your sense of touch. <laughs> okay, I feel it. I feel it deeply. We'll be in touch. I'll bring the money to you. By the way, because I was... That was enough to invite me to dinner tonight. No, it was not. In fact, he's on speakerphone right now. He wants to permission me to do a portrait. Which I told him, I said, it's a brilliant idea. It's brilliant because it bespeaks um, a resolution. But he insists on posing upside down, thrown up on the ceiling like this, and I told him, I said, come on, because how? 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 How can I possibly have taken life? How? Tell me, how? <laughs> I mean, do you know how the roads of America got so smooth? No, tell me. Because that pay with the very bones of smooth guys, the Kazar. Right, Kazar? And really cool guys. Yeah. So what do you want? I want nothing. I want my money, I want my diamonds, I want the picture that comes. Or I swear by the bones of your ass and I'm nuts. You kill me? Like you killed my father. You know, Armand? You know a lot. But more important is what you don't understand. Which is that money, sometimes. Requires a sacrifice. By the way, you finish Olga's portrait? Why? I have a recent shot of her. I'm gonna send it right now. Make it easy for you to finish your work. I had Musa's diamond and his cash. Let's go! He was as angry right, as Lucifer on. when denied the Earth. 
But when he learned that one woman, his most constant lover, had died in this war, a war of his own invention, all of our moments were numbered. You said mattress, a better? You may be right. Boss, boss, what do you want us to do with them? Pave them into the road. Driving. I'm good. I know that. It's just better when the queen's relaxing. Not behind the steering wheel. <laughs> you are something. Watch the road! <laughs> into the road. I told them they were off their gut. side of the road.
map? I know this place. Tomorrow morning, there will be a boat there. And if you can catch it, then for the life of me, I'll miss you. <laughs> She's pretty, isn't she? Paper, it won't ignite. What? Don't look at me like I did something wrong. See? It's heating up. Okay, no more money. somewhere far away sounds like a pretty good idea but you're running on empty that's a little optimistic considering your options you're gonna have to rework the map if you'd have followed orders we could have avoided all of this remember your first hit you asked me, is it possible not to carry out orders? I told you the truth. I said yes, if you're prepared to die. treat your guests? You know, you've been alone too long. What is there to talk about? You know, I heard a lot of stories about you. You smuggling folks out? I do. Depends on who. What can you tell us about yesterday? About those two that come through here? If I told you anything, I'd be screwed. And if you're going to screw me, I prefer you buy me dinner first. Don't think we forget what you're about, Bookie. So stop fucking around. Take him out. So where are they? Don't test my conscience. I have no boss but my own conscience. And you're acting like my boss. I'm not your boss. I'm just trying to save these kids' lives. And if you don't tell me, I'm gonna burn your little shack to the ground. I'm under official orders to bring those kids back. And why are you giving up your life for strangers, huh? Don't be an idiot! You drove over 5,000 kilometers to some shack from which now you can get lost. She stole from Musa. Ah, Musa again. I'm tired of that Musa. Just give me the information and we're out of here. Have it in just a minute. It's in the cabin. I'll get it for you. 
and if you need some lead to write it down, I'll give that to you too. <laughs> Die. 
Up there, waiting for us. Prepared to kill me? Yes. So you ready for both of us right now to die? Leaving you alone? Take the money and leave us alone. Sick of this. No! The thing I missed. No. Shot you. Both of you. Yeah, I've got the money with me. Here's the money, as I promised you. Good boy. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, hold on. Why did Let you do explain. it? Listen, please. Freedom and love are worth more than money. Are you crazy? I gave something that's worth less to get something that's worth more. I can't believe you're saying Stop that. Stop a second. You 
instructions completed, just as you planned. Everything's in place. We'll get to the coast, we take the money. It's your door. Sounds right. We'll take the money? <laughs> you wouldn't let me down now, would you? Of course not. Good. Good boy. left. Go back to the city. You know what to do. And you? The kids have left to start their own families. Their mother's been sick for a while. I'm going home. Life is short and unpredictable. You be sure and take care of yourself, Captain. I knew he was alive. I could hear his heart beating. You help us. Give me your hand. Better we cut our losses, huh? I don't even know how I found you. Let's get rid of this for starters. Why did you follow me? Just be happy I did. <laughs> dreamed of leaving everything behind. Whatever it is, or my life was, most of us dream to be anything but ourselves. Most of us wish, and to wish is all it will ever be. And to dream is to dream until we wake up.